So what's up everybody, Retro Sneakers here, back at y'all with a new video. In today's video, I'll be doing a restoration on a pair of Bull 9s from 1993. To start off this restoration, the first step I'll be doing is removing the crumbled midsole. To make this happen, I'll be using cotter rounds, acetone, and a heat gun. So to start off this process, the first step I'll be doing is heating up the area with the excess midsole. Once I've done that, I'm going to apply acetone to a cotter round and then rub away the excess midsole. And that's all you got to do. So yeah, let's get into it. So now that all the old excess midsole is removed, I can begin giving these shoes a cleanup. To clean them up, I'll be using Rejuvenator Advanced Sneaker Solution along with the sole and suede brush. The reason I'm using a suede brush is because I have to be very careful when it comes down to cleaning the Durabuck. So I'm just going to be lightly cleaning the Durabuck so I don't cause any type of damage. Yeah. What you on, yeah. I can tell you a fraud, yeah. They can tell I'm a boss, count them dead presidents, all, oh, yeah. Keep them jealous, like all, oh, yeah. Ben's Lexus is all, oh, yeah. I can tell you a fraud, count yeah. them dead presidents, all, oh, yeah. I can tell what people really on. Smiles don't match when they shake my palm, and I keep my backhand like the doll, and I keep my bitch in the Saint Laurent, and I force the issue that I'm up next, and I press issues like man's health, and I lost respect for some. So the next step we're moving on to now is separate the donors as you can see right here I got a pair of citrus nines from 2010 these are gonna separate easily without a problem and you already know to separate them I'm gonna be doing the hot boiling water method and to speed up the process I'll be using some nail polish remover I got the midsoles completely separated so now I can begin putting in some work on them. And let me know down below in the comments if it hurt y'all to watch those donors get torn apart. Cause I know some of y'all out there just cringe seeing that. All right, so what I'll be doing now is removing the paint from the midsoles. To make this happen, I'll be using a midsole paint remover from God of Souls. To remove the paint, all I gotta do is apply the remover onto the midsoles, let it sit for about 15, 20 seconds, and then come back to it and rub away the paint. What's up everybody? Are you in need of something that will make your life 10 times better? Then talk to your doctor about Bar Super Stick Cement. 
Bar Cement works to make your life better with this strong, fast acting formula. That girl won't text you back? Barge. Your shoes are talking? Barge. If you don't believe me, just listen to these success stories. Thanks to Barge, I now get all the Yeezys for retail. My life has been so much better, but my girlfriend still cheats on me. So be like this guy and go buy a can of Barge today. I don't want to do this, Jose. What do you mean? Just say the line. I don't want to do this anymore, Hoss. Just say it, Andrew. No, it's stupid. Hey, we're filming. Just say the line into the camera. <sighs> Bargement is bullshit. So go out and buy a cat today. Make the change for the better. And watch your whole life turn into a banger. I just went hit on my plug. Yeah, he told me he with the shits. Okay, ride it round in the old Yeah, give me some head and I deal. Okay, yeah. all of my niggas they count cash. Yeah. Count it till we break a wrist. Yeah, just got a test for my old bitch. Uh, I tell her new for who this? Who yeah. this? I tell her new for who this? Uh, who this? I tell her new for who this? Okay, I tell her new. For who so the next step I'm moving on to now is sanding down the midsoles. The reason I'm doing this is to remove the factory adhesive and also to allow proper fitment within the uppers and the soles. To get this job done, I'll be using a Dremel and a sanding stone. Yeah, I feel like the world is mine. 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 Yeah. So now that the midsoles are completely prepped, I can begin the re-gluing process. The glue I'll be using to get this done is Bar Super Stick Cement. I'll be applying one coat to the midsoles and the soles, allow them to cure for a couple minutes, and then come back to it and heat it up with the heat gun and clamp them together. So what's up y'all, we're gonna be taking a quick break from this video cause I got a new giveaway. So in this giveaway, I'm gonna be giving away a kit. This kit will include a paintbrush set, white and black Angelus paint, and acetone and cotter rounds. These are just the basic tools to perform a repaint, so if you're looking to do that, make sure you enter this giveaway. To enter this giveaway, all you gotta do is follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter. The second step is to comment down below your thoughts on this video, this restoration, and the skit. And in that same comment that you leave, I also want you to put your Instagram or Twitter handle so I can get in touch with you to get you your prize. And the third and final step you gotta do is subscribe to my channel and like this video. Once you've completed all those steps, you enter the giveaway and next Next Tuesday, I will be picking five random winners for this giveaway. Let's get back to this restoration. So now it's time to start gluing the uppers. Again, I'll be using bars to make this happen. The only thing I'll be doing differently this time is the gluing method. I'm gonna start off by applying one light coat onto the midsoles and then let them cure for three hours. Pulling cold day like a sun, 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 pulling cold day like a sun,
Sipping scissor, pull up to your block like what's up? Smoking the ass of the perp, I just finesse with the words. Yo, girl, she get on my nerves. Can't love her, that's for the birds. I strap a pack to a bird. They listen to when I'm. Hey Siri, set a timer for three hours. Okay, your timer is set for three hours. Now that three whole hours have passed, I can begin applying the second coat onto the midsoles and I'm gonna be applying the first coat onto the uppers. And I'm gonna let these cure for two hours and then come back to them, heat them up using the heat gun and clamp them together. So the next step I'll be doing now is painting the midsoles. The paint I'll be using is regular black Angelus paint. And to top off the repaint, I'll be using a Krylon matte finish. Alright y'all, so we got a little problem. The plastic globe on the pull tab is cracking. It's very weak and I'm able just to break it off using my hands. So to fix this, I'm going to be swapping out the globe from the Citrus 9 donors. I'll be cutting it using an X-Acto knife and then painting the globe red. The new globe is now ready to be glued, but before I glue them on, I'm going to be applying some acetone onto the area I'll be gluing. So yeah, let's get into the final step. So thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and leave a comment down below letting me know your thoughts. And make sure y'all follow me on all my social media accounts. My Instagram is Jose Reminis. My Snapchat is Retro Snickers. And my Twitter is Retro Snickers. Also, make sure y'all enter the new giveaway. All details for that will be down below in the description. So yeah, thank you so much for watching this video and have a great day.